Watching 13 on your side. More than two dozen dogs are headed to a West Michigan animal shelter after thousands were rescued from a shutdown breeding facility in Virginia. 13 on your side's Andrea Flores is here now with details. Andrea. Nate, more than 20 beagles will soon be here in West Michigan and will need plenty of support before eventually finding their forever homes really excited to help give these dogs a second chance. The Humane Society of West Michigan is expecting 25 beagles to arrive within the next two weeks. We are open to taking adults, puppies. We're expecting a lot of them to arrive pretty sick. The dogs are coming from a breeding and research facility in Virginia, which the feds shut down after numerous animal welfare violations were found. About 4,000 beagles are being distributed to shelters across the country. They'll probably need pretty extensive medical care as well as definitely behavioral assistance. As these animals were kept in tiny, tiny cages, they don't, they never, they didn't have names. Um, they barely interacted with humans in any way that was positive. Since everything developed quickly, the Humane Society is raising money to make sure they have everything they need to take care of these beagles. Our medical team is going to get to work right away, making sure that we address everything that we can, make sure they're healthy, they're fixed. Brianna Shaley with the Humane Society says they want to line up foster homes as soon as possible, too. Oftentimes, actually, the best way to socialize these animals rather than keeping them in the shelter is sending them straight to foster homes. She says the dogs will likely not be trained and will be nervous, but she expects them to really grow into their new homes. We're really looking for loving, patient foster families that can understand where these dogs have been um, and the sort of help and support that they'll need moving forward until they can find their loving forever home. Since the Beagles will need plenty of medical care and socializing in their foster homes first, they'll probably not be available for adoption for some time. For the links to their fundraiser and how to apply to become a foster, you can find that on our website, 13onyourside.com. Nate?